Hi everyone, I'm glad to see you on my channel. I'm Inna Maksimova and I'm a nail master. I love to do beautiful nail designs and I want to share my works with you. I show all the designs step by step so that everyone can repeat them. Subscribe to my channel and click the bell button not to miss new videos. I'm working with a client today. The old cotton has grown and requires correction. I take off the old material. I work with the cutter carefully. I do not press on the nail. I work in forward mode. The speed is 17,000 revolutions. Right away I correct the length according to the client's request. I shape the three border of the nail with a file, filing from the points of ingrowth and rounding to the tip. Level the nail from below with a file. I just put the file under the nail and correct it. I'm going over the surface with the file, removing the anemesis that was left after working with a cutter. Now the manicure. I work with a flame cutter with a red notch. With my thumb I pull the client's skin up to see the cuticular pocket. I clean all dry skin. In forward mode I clean it from the left side. And on the reverse, clean from the right side. I carefully remove the dust under the cuticle and side walls. I apply a primer on the prepared nails. Nails are not problematic and not wet, so I use an exit-free primer. Now it's time for the base coat. If you prepare your nails well and use a file to level the surface, then there will be no problems with leveling, especially with a base that has a self-leveling quality. The rubber base fits this description perfectly. I put a small drop in the apex zone and spread the material over the nail. You can turn the hand with the nail down. The material would flow into the correct shape and a beautiful even overtone would be achieved. admiring the result. Now it's time for the color coating. The client chose a very beautiful delicate lilac tone. I put it on all nails, except for the ring finger. There will be a design.
On the second layer I level the cuticle, so that when it growing back, there would be a smooth, neat line of color. Now we need this kind of holographic foil. I've put it on AliExpress. The link to the seller will be in the description. I cut off two strips in straight line and cut off one wave strip. The second side of this strip I cut straight. Under the foil I apply a thin layer of base coat. The top part of the foil I cut off along the cuticle line. I place the strip to the side. Now we need a strip with a wave shape. Round it of the cuticle and place next. There should be no gap between the strips. After drying in the lamp, I remove the transparent film and the holography remains on the nail. I do the same on the other side. I dry and remove the transparent base coat. Such a beauty! The tone is slightly darker than the main color. I apply it in the center. There will also be the foil on the second hand. I cut out a wavy strip. Right away, cut off the strip in the bow shape for the cuticle and cut straight line in the center. On the second hand on the nail of the ring finger, I apply the main color, which is also on the other nails. I apply a thin layer of base coat and place the foil. I cover all the nails with a top coat without a sticky layer. Nails with a foil cover up with two layers of top coat. We need a white gel paint without a sticky layer. I draw a pattern in the center of the nail. The design is simple. I draw a line in the center and then more lines to it from both sides. It looks like a feather.
That's how such simple in realization but very beautiful design comes out. The foil shimmers very beautifully. I hope you liked the video, so I'm waiting for your likes and comments. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, there are many interesting videos and beautiful designs ahead. That's all for today, take care, all the best and have a nice day.